definitely get on her mom's good side first. If you're not an Arab and your girl is Muslim, Godspeed. If she doesn't seem crazy at first, just wait. It's coming. Get used to the fact that her family yells a lot, and it's not because they're crazy or angry. Or maybe it is. She's the world's greatest investigator. If another girl even glances in your direction, she will give them the ain. And you need to figure out what the ain is. I'll just tell you. It means the evil eye. Basically, it's her exuding her wrath mixed with supernatural powers to ruin that other girl's life. <laughs> this is a real thing. She'll be the best cook you ever dated. If you have an ego, her family will rip that right away from you. Get used to going to hookah bars for all her friends' birthdays. Get used to smoking more hookah. You're probably gonna have to check all the cars in a parking lot before you walk into a restaurant just to make sure like her aunt or her uncle or her second cousin or anybody related to her is not there. She will love you if you bring a flask with you to an Arab wedding because there's a 99% chance it's gonna be alcohol free. You Don't Mess With The Zohan is her favorite Adam Sandler movie. If you're walking around the mall and she spots a hijabi, she will run into the nearest store and hide in the dressing room. Costco is off limits because there's always the chance that somebody her dad knows is gonna be shopping for their liquor store there at all times. She only wears gold. No silver. Gold. She might scream out profanities in Arabic from time to time, so don't be alarmed. Chances are, because she's an Arab and she's crazy, she has really bad road rage, so you should probably drive. Plan to witness some drama. Or a lot. Arabs love drama. She'll complain to you nonstop about her friends and then go hang out with said friends later. We all do it. It's gonna be a while before you see her without makeup. She may be high maintenance, but she makes up for that with her cooking. No pork for her doesn't mean she will not cook you bacon, okay? So let's just all relax. You're still gonna get your pork. There will be tea brewing frequently. Don't try to tell her what she can and cannot wear. She gets that enough from her entire family! Her birthday, to her, is like a national holiday. So you treat it as such. If you even consider marriage, you go to her parents first. If you thought your friends were crazy, just wait till you meet her friends. They're psychotic. You better get used to being around smokers because guaranteed at least half of her family smokes cigarettes. If you got this far and you're still not scared away, then you should be just fine. 